everyone, Shipper 1000 here. Today, we're going to be doing a quick review, just a quick video. Uh, like I mentioned in my last video, these are a couple things that I was supposed to do while on my cursed camping trip that I totally, absolutely forgot. We had them there, but I forgot them. We're going to do these sunflower seeds. Um, these are Frank's Red Hot, you know, the, the sauce. I put that on everything. <laughs> But, now, I was thinking in the last one, we may have done these before. Now, I don't know if we've done these ones, but I know we've done the bacon ones and a couple different flavors of these things. Um, so, yeah, um, we're going to open these up and give them a shot. But first, I'll show you the uh, nutrition facts. Um, let's just see down here. It's got 13 grams of protein per serving. I don't know what they consider a serving in sunflower seeds. It all began in 1926 inside a small grocery store in Fresno, California, where David's sunflower seeds were roasted and <coughs> excuse me <coughs> were roasted and seasoned with quality ingredients. Almost 100 years later. We still craft our quality seeds with care. Why? Because the best things in life are often the simplest. David. So here's the nutrition facts. If I can get you. And there's what I just read. Yes, I don't know how much is in a serving. One serving per per container okay one package is 48 grams of kernels plus seasoning on shell okay but this is 13 grams of protein so apparently this is one serving so I don't know we're gonna try them let's go ahead and open these up I'll Turn you down here. Probably should have the scissors out. Okay, so we're going to get a couple of these. Pop them in the mouth. Let's see. They're hot, not like super dino whopping hot. There's a little bit of heat. I'm not. I'm not tasting the Frank's Red Hot. I love Frank's Red Hot. I'm just not tasting it. I'm tasting hot sauce. It tastes more like a Tabasco to me more than it does Frank's Red Hot. I crack, crack one open here. But the other flavored ones we did, Monkey and I, they were pretty good. I can't remember if bacon was my favorite, but one of them actually got into the seed, the flavor. It was really good. This one, it is hot, but to me, it tastes nothing like Frank's Red Hot. A little disappointed. Um, The seeds themselves, I mean, these are supposed to be jumbo. I've had bigger seeds than this. The seeds are mediocre. I give them a three. The flavor, I can't really tell you a flavor other than it is hot. But if you tried this, you couldn't say this is Frank's Red Hot. You couldn't say, oh, that tastes just like Frank's Red Hot. I don't care who you are. 
that's not going to happen with these. If somebody just gave you a handful and said, what's these taste like? They're going to say, they're hot. That's it. Overall, I'm just going with three and a half out of five star. I was really excited for this one. They're good. They're not spectacular in any way. And in no way whatsoever do they taste like Frank's Red Hot Sauce. Not at all. So, alright guys, there you go. Three and a half stars. I'll give it a one thumbs up. Because they're not really jumbo. They're not huge. I mean, they're, they're just pretty much just uh, sunflowers seen I mean <laughs> all right guys thanks for watching I appreciate it Shea Bear the myth the man a legend gone for now tomorrow's New Year's Eve so happy New Year everyone we'll see you in the next one stay safe enjoy life <laughs> bye bye guys take care of yourselves